remain steady. Many are wondering what the next steps are to get the economy back open. Sam Spangler spoke with a pandemic logistics expert and is more on a story new at 10. Retired Marines Lieutenant Colonel Hal Kempfer used to work here in Hawaii coordinating pandemic responses. Now, he says the COVID-19 outbreak is so eerily similar to simulations they used to run that he believes there is a playbook to opening up Hawaii's tourism-based economy while maintaining safety. You know, what we don't want to do is reopen too quickly and we have another massive outbreak as bad or worse than what we had before and then we have to shut down. To remain safe but still get Hawaii's economy back running, Kempfer says the playbook would begin with expanded testing. Um, I know one of them is about 98% accurate, which is pretty darn good. Uh, and it can tell you within about five to 10 minutes uh, from literally, you know, poking your finger, taking blood, putting it in a little test kit thing. It can tell you very quickly whether you have it, don't have it, or ever had it. For crowded spaces like airports, surveillance to see who is sick. There's some very advanced technology from the military and defense side of the house where they can actually stand off, put sensors up, look down at crowd, see who's got an illness-based fever versus an activity-based fever. Then, contact tracing. Apple and Google are working together to determine if someone was in contact with a COVID-19 positive person by using phone location. You know, when you get an ad on your phone, you're like, well, how do they know that I was thinking about uh, getting something at Burger King? They were tracking where you were, and they saw that you went to Burger King more often than you went to McDonald's or someplace else. Same commercial application of cell phone technology is to track people to see where they've been. Finally, disinfecting common areas, which could even use fogging like we've seen in China. Having a, a small squadron of drones flying down Waikiki, disinfecting Waikiki, uh, disinfecting the sidewalks, disinfecting... The, the park areas, disinfecting anything where the kids would climb around. Kempfer added that he's working in Las Vegas right now with a persistence agent that's applied to surfaces and kills viruses on contact. Now, they're applying it on poker chips with success, but I've yet to find anything that works with playing cards. Sam Spangler, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.